Look, I'm sorry to dump this on you, but you're gonna need to live without me for a little while. It'll be quick, but I need time off to wrap up some personal things. It's a little sudden, isn't it? What's going on? Nothing big, just some private stuff. And I was worried I'd miss your departure. Kaleo, we've had our differences, but I wanted to wish you the best of luck. I'm sure the Wheezer and his revolutionary Edge Brigade will be delighted to have you back. I don't know what you're talking about. I'm surprised that you would permit this, though. Letting Kaleo see her old anarchist friends must violate any number of Imperial regulations. If you're planning a betrayal, I swear to you. That's not it. I wasn't going to betray you. Then why the encoded messages sent from this ship between you and the leader of the Brental Anarchists? That's... look. It's not what you think. The Weezer got in touch, said he needed help. Didn't say why, but I figure security's cracking down on the cell again. This man leads your old anarchist group. He's one of the guys who started it. He taught me everything. He's hit mostly corporate targets, but Imperial assets seem fair game for the REB as well. Just less convenient. The Weezer was good to me, so I thought I'd lend a hand. Figured telling you would make trouble, get someone killed. If you don't trust me, come back with me and watch my back. We'll buy him off somehow. Might actually survive that way. I can make contact myself. Or go through the Citadel. He doesn't want your help and he doesn't trust you. It has to be me. She may have a point. And if the Weezer is expecting her, he's a problem that must be addressed. We'll do this. But we do it my way. You step out of line. Yeah, I got it. I'll get in touch with him. One call to set up the meeting. I'll leave you to your work. We're all set. The Weezer will meet us at the Hutta spaceport. Just... try to make this go without a fight. I don't need to lose either of you. Remember, we're not here to make trouble. You start something, I get unhappy. Calio, of all the gifts you've sent to me, this is truly the finest. An agent of Imperial Intelligence. How marvelous. I don't understand what you mean. Kaleo has been selling information to the Revolutionary Edge Brigade ever since she joined the Empire. What are you doing? Imperial security data, spaceport blueprints, the names of powerful people, useful things. But now, she's gone beyond the call of duty. You've been selling our secrets to anarchists. It's not how he makes it sound. This wasn't what we agreed. Why bother keeping it private when your associate dies anyway? She's more useful dead than alive. Her hands and eyes can get us through biometric security scans. This isn't a harvest job. Then I apologize for misreading our agreement, but this is too promising an opportunity to pass up. I fought the eagle in his nest. As terrorists go. You're barely worth a footnote. Damn it, Agent! No mercy. I'm disappointed with you, Kaleo. You were never a believer. But siding with the Empire? I didn't want to pick a side. So yeah, I sold him a few secrets. He paid better than you do, and it's not like I got you in trouble. How long have you two been working together? I don't know. First time we went to Droman Kass, I sent him some stuff. Just became a regular thing. I didn't talk about the missions. I'm not stupid. He was into bombing spaceports and raiding transports, not espionage and conspiracies. The Empire gave you a job. It gave you protection. In return, you sold us out. What? Us? I didn't sell you out. I kept you from knowing for your sake. 
You should know by now that I am never going to care about the Empire. Not like you do. Not at all. I don't need you to care. But I can't have a traitor on my team. Step out of line again. And you're dead, understand? Yeah, I understand. I'm your freaking prisoner. Let's get out of here.